What's up guys? So today's video, I'm gonna be displaying everything in my inventory because a few people have been asking for it in the comments to just see what I have with me being power 127 and having 418 days played in this game to see what I have to show for all those days and all those hours uh, put into this game. So let's just quickly start with schematics. Now, after once this is done, I'll show you guys a quick way to be able to see what anyone's inventory is. But real quickly, I'll just show you in game what my inventory is. So basically, I mean, it's a lot of random stuff. The only 130 weapons I have, they're both siege breakers and they both have the same. Uh, actually, hang on. I, I, was, I was trying to change this. I'm going to change it to fire rate and damage because that's actually the best one all right so this one i was going to leave the same because i don't use sunbeam or bright core that often but with downcrafting coming very soon i maybe i maybe could do a video on that i don't know but we'll I'll, pretty much with this 130 weapon i'll be able to create an obsidian one as well and not just have uh, 130s only with the schematic so I'll be able to create level 4, 3, 2 and level 1 weapons with this when downcrafting comes out in 7.1 so pretty much yeah just a bunch of random guns a lot a lot of the ones that I have ma mainly my ARs there a lot of them have legendary perks that's pretty much what I only use them on like I have two grave diggers that are obsidian and shadow shard and same same perks but they're all they're all legendary out so this i remember i did a video on this not that long ago and it sucks but yeah a few traps this i use as a defender weapon i literally just make this for giving to my defender the assault rifle defender obviously this i still have to perk up and level up but i just put some uh xp into it because i want to use that eventually with my ranger Bunch more traps, the jack o' launcher, the, a judge, a last word. This is definitely my favorite pistol by far. A few more shotguns, two obliterators, just more random guns. Oh, the Ralphie's Revenge. I'm hoping to get this. I'm hoping this comes back this Christmas for the event too. Like the same way the, what is it? The frost, whatever. The frostbite i actually have one i have one and i still have to buy the one that's in the shop right now so then i could have two but i never even leveled up the first one because the frostbite seemed mediocre to me so i never really had an interest in leveling it up so yeah pretty much another siege breaker all maxed out i mean i may as well recycle nah I can't, i'm not gonna recycle it it has different perks and i put way too much legendary perk but with the new um downcrafting i already have a 130 siege breaker so I, this is kind of useless but i'll still use it and then a bunch uh, oh the swan that's a really good weapon that i have that i like a lot tiny revenge of death or instrument of death bunch of random guns and traps and then founder's revolt love this gun love my wraith another gun i love i love the whisper that's a really good gun bunch more random stuff so i mean if you guys want to see everything i have i'll show you how you can check that at the end of the video but first let's get to my heroes basically i have i'm pretty sure i have every mythic in the game besides phase scout jess and she's an, she's the outlander mythic and in my opinion she's garbage i, I don't like her at all but I still want to have her just to have her but other than that yeah pretty much every mythic not all of them are leveled up actually or all of them are but i got a bunch of ram stuff down here they don't use but yeah that's pretty much it the main hero that i use that i'm here using right now is enforcer grizzly the reason i like him so much is because you can pretty much afk and still do missions you just throw out your teddy there and as long as you have uh shuriken master bonus to for ability damage and carbide to increase the duration 
you pretty much can go AFK. You just use your turrets and your grizzly, and that's it. But other than that, bunch more random heroes that you guys can all see. A lot of these I do not use. I just have them for support bonuses or I don't know. I, I can't even remember the last time I used Machinist Harper. <laughs> but a bunch of random stuff. I have nothing to collect collection book. All right, so now let's go to my survivors. I only have seven mythic leads here. I'll just go to squads. I still need one for this, but my OCD is like insane. So I have them already. Here, let's go to collection book. Personnel, unique leads. I already have some unique doctors, but I don't, they won't be unique as in their personality won't be different if I used one of them. And I don't have enough legendary survivors of either of these personalities extra to make another full squad with those personalities. Pretty much I'm waiting for a few more super people llamas to eventually be able to get one mythic lead for each um, each personality. Because right now I have seven unique ones. So squads. All of these are unique except for the, this one and this one. They're the same personality everything else is a different personality and the thing that sucks is if you go to ma manage this is the personality that i'm missing a, a mythic lead for and i have a bunch of them i have one two three four five six seven and yeah that's all i have but i have seven maybe that's like eight i don't know but i have i, I have seven so I, if i find another mythic with this personality i'll be able to fill it up right away and be able to get the maximum amount of uh, power because I should be 128 if I actually had a better squad because this is literally it's a legendary lead with all epics so there's a lot of points that I'm missing here fort stats for my fortitude that I could have if I had a mythic lead and seven uh, legendary survivors backing it up so all right, now let's go on to the part where I can show you how you can check anyone's inventory at any time that you want. All right, be right back. All right, so here we are. This is stormshield.1 slash PVE. They have a BR version for this. You can see everyone's stats for BR if you'd like to. But I use it to be able to see missions, like if there's V-Bucks alerts, or see what other people's have, and if what their level is, etc, etc. So, to be able to see what my inventory is, right here you just put my name in, but I already have it bookmarked, so we can just go there. And then, right here, you'll see all of, of my, all my information, literally everything. Like even what gadgets I use, my fort stats, what heroes I'm currently using, information on my alert cooldowns, storm cooldowns, all that stuff. And obviously all uh, my uh, survivors. But to be able to see my schematics, you'll see these two tabs right here. Go to schematics. And you can see all of my schematics. Whenever you want to, whatever you want to. So if you ever are watching my, one of my videos and want to see what my in, in, my inventory is just type my name in and store shield one slash pv and then you can see literally everything same for the heroes as well so yeah this is literally all the, everything i have for the heroes you can see all of my heroes from highest level to lowest level meaning i don't actually use them at all so yeah that's pretty much it so make sure you guys use storm shield one it's a great reference for this game and if you ever want to know what missions the there's so much information on storm shield believe me you can see all of the expired llamas how we just had two super people llamas after not having it for 50 days and you can see all the missions literally and just to be able to play the game if you see that there are V-Buck alerts, you can uh, check mission alerts and V-Bucks and sometimes it doesn't work 
because it's buggy, but you can just scroll down and see all the alerts, and there are two currently right now, and I actually have to do one right now. But yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. Check out Storm Shield 1 if you want to see any, any more information, and yeah, I'll see you next time. Peace.